Hello everyone, welcome back to Ingrid Joy Remis. My name is Ingrid. Today we're going to be um, using melt and pour soap. So um, today I have some leftovers that I had before. So um, what happened is that I used some, um, some coffee on top of these ones. So today I'm going to be reusing these um turmeric soap and i'm gonna show you how you can reuse your soap and turn it into a beautiful soap so um let's go ahead and chop these up i start already um you need to cut that if you're, you're gonna you need a microwave a pouring cup a spatula um you're gonna need your essential oil your cutting board of course um, you're gonna need your turmeric because you need to put turmeric in there if you need to and um, Yeah, yeah um, As you can see right here, it is some coffee that's in there So I'm still gonna throw it in there because you know what? It's not like I'm giving it to anyone. This is my home use and I just want to show you how you can um, turn it into something beautiful also i'm gonna need to add some more um turmeric into this i go ahead already and i add some in there but i forget to turn my camera on so i'm gonna need about 12 drops in here and um i know it's 12 drops already because i can i measure it from the the dropper already So give it a good stir, about 12, um, 12, um, sorry, not 12, two minutes, stir it in. Usually that's what it is. Um, as you can see here, I have no bubbles, but if you actually get some bubbles, just go ahead and use a spray bottle with some rubbing alcohol and give it a good spray down. So let's pour these out. Let's see how much we get from it. And we want to pour it in. We want to fill up all the way to the top. As you can see, um, these one they start forming already. So anything you're doing, like pouring more, you have to do it fast. So we have some left over here, and I can see a lot of turmeric um, on the bottom of this one. Even though I give it a good stir, but it is fine. So um, while my while I'm um, waiting for these to be um, setting, I am taking the time to cut some uh, melt and pour. So um, what's happening is that I um, mold these before and um, not using them. So I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to cut these up. Um, cutting these melt and pour guys feel so relaxing um, I can cut these all day long just all day long <laughs> um, I need a job in co in cutting um, soaps because it just feels so nice it just feels so relaxing can you imagine just me just cutting it right now that's how relaxing it is it just soft and I mean even if you even if you have a dull knife it wouldn't be a problem whatsoever so right now um because these um this turmeric soap is um melting um setting i just take time to cut these and you can follow along 
I'm going to be throwing up some information for you um, so you can see um, how to make your soap and it is just so easy so while using poor mel soap guys it is just oils in the soap and glycerin and um, also if you want to know what's in these soaps let me know because um, I don't make these soaps I buy them like how it is and I shape them the way I want and I had whatever I want um, when making soap you um, use something called lye and um, lye is very very dangerous you cannot have lye around children um, whenever using lye you have to use um, a long gloves you have to actually put a goggles on because it is so dangerous for the skin and guess what guys you're putting it in soap so the soap that you're using um, they all contain um, lye and you can go ahead and research lye or if you need some information on lye you let me know and um, I can actually um, give you some more information on that um, so the best soap I think to use especially in your face guys it's these soaps here um, they are very gentle on your skin the thing is um, with the bar the other bar soap that you will be used and give you good uh, give yourself a good lather um, these um, they have sud they make good bubbles but not as much as um, the regular soap that people use um, so I will never um, I will never tell anyone that I love um, to go use bar soap that sell in the store that's why they're so cheaper the bar soap in the store you will um, you will buy one bar soap for six for probably say six dollars or seven dollars depends and even if you go to the dollar store you'll it will be much cheaper as well but also um, you know it's cheap to make um, so that's why they sell it cheaper but if you have to have um, a one pound um, of melt and pour soap it's gonna cost you around twelve dollars for the one pound it is heavy so the tub is very small so this is why these um, melt and pour or um, expensive and um, I mean you can't put um, a price and your health whatsoever because whatever in those soaps anyways getting straight in your body guys anything that you use on your skin it absorbs straight to your bloodstream so here I am ready right now to unmold these um, these turmeric soap so let's get started and I'm also going to unmold um, the coffee scrub that I had before as you can see the coffee the coffee scrub is not looking very pretty but it's fine it's just samples but when they're coming out I'm pretty sure they're gonna look fantastic so as you can see here um, it's very smooth um, so it's not much to do there's nothing really um, to do like you know cutting off anything or say um, you know take a knife and have to cut something because you know it's rough or anything like that this mold that I use here is very very nice and it also have a pattern on the bottom I don't know if you can see the pattern um, on this side um, but this side yes I think you would be able to see
I don't know if you can see the pattern. But as you can see, um, this mold, there is nothing really to um, cut or anything like that. It's just mold from um, corner to corner. So these are the um, soap. You can see how pretty they are. These are the soap that I had before and you see me cutting um, in the beginning of this video. So if you've never seen the beginning of the video, go back and watch the beginning of the video. And this is just the leftover that I have and you can see how it's mold beautifully. So let's go ahead and um and mold these small little sample of coffee scrub and you can see there it's good size this one is a very good size this one is very very small comparing to this one I hope everyone's having a wonderful day um, keep watching and I will show you the rest of these um, coffee scrub that I'm molding and you're gonna see how some is smaller than some um, please watch to the end and please take care of yourself and also your skin guys it's very very important to take care of your skin So I hope you've been um, enjoying um, this video. Um, as you can see, these little samples are turning out really nice. And then these turmeric soap are beautiful as well. As you can see the bottom of it, it's beautiful um, pattern there. So. I want everyone to take care until I see you in the next video. Bye for now.